Hi everyone, my name is Ruchin and I welcome you to Yourpedia. So as you all know that Yourpedia has been conducting various sessions to create awareness among uh, civil engineers, environmental engineers, electrical engineers for opportunities in abroad. So abroad mein jo jo opportunities hai, uske baare mein we discuss. So I have come across one such opportunity which is for civil engineers. Okay, civil engineer PhD op opportunity hai. Kahan pe? Germany mein. That is in Brandenburg University of Technology. Brandenburg University of Technology. Most important best part here is that there is no tuition fee hai and you, you will get good scholarship also. So let's talk about in detail what is this university, what is deadline is in it. Okay, since the uh, topic is very lucrative, there is no tuition fee, nahi hai, scholarship, mil so a lot of people are going to apply. So you need to do something different for it to get uh, into this college. Okay, so let's see. This is a PhD program in environmental and resource management. PhD in environmental sciences. And that the more information will be available to you in the coming days. Uh, it will be released on 1st of October. And currently the tuition fee is none. There is no uh, tuition fee. Also, uh, the language is English. So there is no uh, barrier for language also. But in uh, slides to come, we'll see there has to be a language criteria. Language test has to be cleared. All right, let's see who is eligible. Again, saying tuition fee per semester is uh, no, there is no uh, tuition fee. Now, the research focuses more on combined efforts from biotechnology, environment, chemistry, health, hygiene, and smart development. These are the topics. And in that, there is a collaboration for different PhDs. Like, the program focuses on, uh, like, uh, climate. Like, you can do studies on climate, like, uh, air changes, to, uh, troposphorical changes and all. Water, soil, ecology, raw materials, economics and law, thereby strengthening the research profile. Okay. Now, this, uh, this uh, program, PhD program, is open both for national and international uh, students. Predominantly, this will be very much useful if you have done your master's in environmental engineering or environmental science. So, like we are, we are creating awareness about environmental science. Like if you give gate exam for, uh, from, uh, after your B.Tech in environmental science, so it gives you a very good opportunity to complete your master's here and then go abroad in environmental science. There are a lot of opportunities. Now, who is eligible? Let's talk about that. But before that, is there any kind of funding opportunity? Yes, there is a funding opportunity. It will be discussed. Like now, there are always limited uh, uh, seats for scholarship. So you need to apply uh, in a very precise manner. There, there we can help you like uh, how to get funding and all. Wh what is the procedure that, that we'll tell you. Next, next comes what are the requirement, academic requirement. First of all, it says that MSc or equivalent degrees, MSc or equivalent, equivalent by equivalent, we mean MTech also is equivalent in environmental science, environmental engineering, environmental ecology, environmental law, chemistry, biotechnology, environmental management and all. These all are eligible if you have done your master's in this. What are the language requirements? Language has to be English. Your complete defense and all the examinations will be in English. So no problem with that. But the only issue is you'll have to qualify a minimum criteria test. Okay, accepted tests are TOEFL, Cambridge Advanced English Test, Cambridge Certificate of Proficiency and IELTS. Out of these four, you need to qualify at least one. Then only you can apply into this. What are the application deadline? First of all, the vacancies or the admissions are being allowed throughout the year. But it is recommended that you should not apply later than 1st of November. 2021 okay so this is the university you can see this is a very good opportunity if you have any doubt regarding like uh, how can i apply what are the uh, domains what what should be my project title and all you can contact us we can help you in writing your sop sor as per the requirement in foreign like how you can go foreign because you need to make a proper uh, sop your sor should be good your dissertation title and all should be very good so we can help you in that. So we'll come again if there is any other kind of opportunity. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.